Okay, hello entities, and welcome to the first episode of um, how to make games using Muratus and Blender. Um, now, I did do a video um, on how to install Muratus and the plugin for Blender. Um, now, I am realizing just now I should have done an install for Blender, but it should be fairly easy. I'll have a link to the Blender website in that description and in this description. Um, but yeah, so to get started we need a, I guess, player. So start off with I'll delete all this stuff. And then up the top here where it says Blender Render, go down to Maratus. Um, don't worry about what I was just doing there. Um, start display so you guys can see what I'm pressing. Now, what I'll do is I'll just do control A and let's say make a cube and then bring that up. Uh, now let's see if I can make something I guess. Okay, so now we have a weird little thing here. <laughs> we just need like a basic model. Um, so yeah, this obviously doesn't have to be um, the finished product. I'll just um, move that up a little bit more. There we go. <laughs> yeah, so uh, just apply the subdivide if you to subdivide. Um, now yes, this does actually require a little bit of knowledge in Blender. Um, it's mainly the Moretta side that I'm trying to teach. Um, so just add a uh, material. Uh, I'll just put a random skin color. This thing. And now with this, if you put this into Muratus, it would have skin color, but it would be way too shiny. It would look like some kind of marble structure. Even just here, it looks really shiny. So on the specular tab down here, on the intensity, just bring that quite a lot down until it looks almost not shiny, I guess. Um, and then this intensity here just makes it a bit darker if you want it to. So you could have like a really pale person or um, some like uh, Southern American or something. So yeah, I'll have it kind of like someone who's tan. Um, so yeah, just save that out, so save, I'll save it in the Muratus thing, I'll make a new folder or something, uh, and I'll call it, uh, oh wait, no, this is the actual thingamablob and hob, uh, create new directory, that's what we want. Uh, then I'll call this Blender Models and open this up. Then we can call it something. So, Test Player. I'll just call it that. Now we want to go into Muratus 
and we want to do file new project and then find wherever your folder is so if it's on the desktop you want to go users then like your username for me it's Logan then desktop then the folder and then I'm just going to call this project um, YouTube tutorial alright I forget I forgot to say uh, enter doesn't work to save or do whatever so now we've got a new project and if we go back into blender and do file export and then down the bottom it should have Maratus mesh if you installed the plugin properly then you want to go to desktop which should be automatically here uh, then find your folder and then in meshes you want to put it so meshes export mesh then go back here and then you want to click on the little person and it says add entity which means like a model or something and now it's already in the meshes folder for me so test player dot mesh you want to click on the mesh not anything else like dot mma you have to click on the dot mesh so we then have a person here <laughs> And you may want to add a light or else it'll look a bit weird. And then camera. Okay, so we may have to rotate the camera. Rotation on Z will be, I think it's minus 90. Oh, I did minus 900, minus 90. No, it's just 90. I keep on getting mixed up with the minus 90 and the 90 that I have to use. So there we go, we have a very basic model in Maratus. In the next tutorial, I'll try and cover at least a little bit of physics and maybe how to model a bit of landscape. Um, probably just, I'll probably just do like floating islands. Um, like in my game Levitate. Uh, so yeah, in the next one I'll do a little bit of land, um, maybe moving your character which will need um, a bit of programming. Uh, not too much, thank gosh, uh, if you're a beginner anyway. Um, so yeah, that may be a fairly long tutorial I might put it into multiple episodes um, but yeah thank you for watching guys and I'll see you in another video bye